We all set? Okay, so my name is Larry Surtees. I'm the Corporate Secretary at National Defence. The Corporate Secretary is an organization of about 135 people. We support the Deputy Minister and the Chief of Defence Staff by coordinating their most senior level meetings of their advisors. We economize the time that they're in meetings so they spend less time in meetings, they spend less time doing what you would probably call wasting their time. Uh, we also work closely with the Vice Chief of Defence Staff in setting the correct agenda for these meetings. Uh, we support the Minister with a whole team of people who provide corporate support and administrative support to his office. So we will help them coordinate their travel, we'll help them coordinate the expenditure of funds and uh, setting up their meetings and making sure they get the briefings that they need in a timely manner. I have another group of people who look after corporate and shared services at a strategic level. So they coordinate our departmental uh, defense uh, administrative orders and directives and QRNOs, as well as doing ministerial correspondence. From the organizational perspective, we look after the access to information and privacy framework so that we can respond to the legislation. We have a number of people who do that, provide advice to level ones, and do the final cut on what we uh, give out under access to information privacy. The people who do the work, I get the glory, and that works out okay, but they know uh, that, uh, that I really appreciate the work that they do. Most places, Friday's like a nice, want, like, relaxed day, you know? No, to you. no. <laughs> total opposite here. We set up the meeting so that we can have uh, all of the level ones and the advisors to the DM and the CDS in very special rooms. We have a smaller conference room here, conference room C, and then we have the larger conference room, conference room B. Can you imagine setting up a meeting of 27 executives all at the same time and trying to work that into their schedule? That's one of the challenges that some of my team has. We also do most of our work by working with others. So we work with the whole defense team to respond to access to information and privacy requests. We work with the whole team in creating the DOAD collection, the QRNOs. I know. How are you? You got my shot. Today, <laughs> sir. Defense renewal from a corporate secretary perspective uh, has been a benefit because we've been able to get three initiatives under the organizational practice component of defense renewal that are allowing us to put forward some of the activities that we need to do. One of those is a governance review, which means revising what we call the organization and accountability document, which describes how we are organized in the headquarters and the accountabilities of all the level ones and how we do our business at the headquarters level. We are then following that up with a review of whether we have the committee structure to support decision making right. The other initiative we're doing is trying to identify a core number of strategic documents that will help everybody understand what we're trying to do at defense, what we call the strategic intent. The third defense renewal initiative relates to the DAODs and revising them and bringing them up to date. Well, the key challenge, as in any job, is understanding the priorities. In our job, the priorities shift on a regular basis, but it works very well in my organization, in the corporate secretary, because of the excellent people that we have and the hard work that they put at doing this job. If you create the environment that allows them to do the best they can, that's where I get my most enjoyment. And that's what our leadership is about in the corporate secretary. We create the environment, we give people the tools, and then we basically sit back and watch what our staff do. And they amaze us every time. That's what I like about my job.